shred that. I'm going to shred that because, no, actually, no, I shouldn't have shred that. Get it back up. I'll leave my fingers in. Unshred. I have a claw like Freddy. Nate, watch your fingers. I think he will have 100 yards. He will. He will. Shred the game. See you later. Shredded face. Let's introduce you to Beavis and Butt Shred. <laughs> I present Ron Popeil. Say it with me, gentlemen. What we got here? Shredded Shred and, and forget it. There we Look go. Look at Ron. It's back for the stretch run towards your fantasy playoffs. I thought it'd be a perfect time to bring back the shredder so you know which fantasy trends will continue, what's going to happen in week 12, what's true, what's not, what gets shredded, what stays put together. It's called Shreddy, Shreddy, or not. Will you All help right. me out? I like it, sure. Yeah. Not a shredder. We, got? we had hundreds of submissions. Oh, this thing's good. Julian heavy. Shreddleman and Shredarius Smith, but here oh. we have Kira Shredrick. Very good. <laughs> Kira, hey, you got the closer out here. You got the closer. <laughs> This wow, is what I decided to win with because this felt the most appropriate for our breakfast table this morning for our show. Love during singles. You got to. Fantastic. You, you're gonna you're gonna think I'm crazy. <laughs> this is my favorite one because this is a deep cut. I, I, Shreddy Van Halen, Shreddy Mercury, obvious. Of course. Shredrick, fantastic. Yeah, Shreddy Krueger, Tom Pirates Shreddy, with all your of husband. that. Does anybody have any questions? I do. For I do. Shreddy? I do. Miss Shredrick. Um, <laughs> Aaron Rodgers currently having a good season win-loss wise, yet he is the 13th ranked quarterback in the wow. fantasy rankings this week. So I present you to this, Ms. Adams. Yes. Aaron Rodgers will finish outside the top 10 quarterbacks this week when they're playing the Niners. I feel like this is a little, everybody needs to pump the brakes on Aaron Rodgers. Yes, he only has one touchdown the last three weeks, the last two games. He's coming off a bye. He's had a bye week to prepare for his competition this week. Devonta Adams should be back and healthy and active. Let's not forget, he's still a top 10 fantasy quarterback when all is said and done so i know it's a tough matchup against the niners kyler put up points against the niners we russell wilson we've seen success through the air on the ground so i'm gonna shred this and if we look at the rankings over at nfl.com he is going 13th and i don't really agree with it i mean i like Carr and baker over aaron Rodgers. i'll give you that but I like Rodgers over Dak. Dak's got the Patriots. I like Rodgers over Wentz and Jameis, which is enough to put him inside the top ten. So, Shia. Okay, look out for Eric Armstrong. Oh, yeah. Shia, shred you later. Hanging with Travolta and Phenomenon, too, very good. She married Kevin Bacon. Oh. One degree of separation. One degree of separation. There you go. Um, all right, this segment always provides some uh, shred educational value, so I'm going to ask you about <laughs> Lenny Fournette, all right, he has slowed down a little bit of late. Will he, he will have 100-plus scrimmage yards for the first time in four weeks, Lenny Fournette? There's only one running back who's had 100 yards on this Titans run defense. It's Christian McCaffrey. Mm. I don't think Leonard Fournette does it. If you look at what happened last time they played each other, week four, Leonard Fournette could not get anything done. In fact, he had negative yardage until late in the game. And you can take a look right here. He broke off a 69-yard run oh, okay. and finally got it going. Negative yardage, broke the run. So, I mean, after that, he finished with 66 rush yards. To me, one touchdown this season, more concerning than that, he's been getting bottled up lately, and it's not getting easier against the Titans. They stopped the run to pretty much everybody. So I'm going to say I'm going to shred this. Whoa. He's involved in the receiving game, and if you're in a PPR league, play him, but I don't think he gets 100 on the ground. Mm, Doug Marone's got some questions to answer. Wow. All right, yeah, let's go time. to... Loved her oh, secondhand lines. B J. <laughs> that is Odell Beckham. Uh huh. You've been watching him, right? He will finish outside of the top ten at wide receivers for the tenth straight week. He's finished outside tenth the top straight. forty <laughs> at wide receiver five different oh, yeah, times yeah, yeah. this season. It has yeah. not been great. A lot of people took him really early in this one, and if you look at his PPR ranks uh, by week. Where he's finished and what he's got going on. Ooh, I don't know. You're starting to see the Browns feature more of late. 22 targets for the last two weeks. I don't know. He's drawn some penalties. The Baker's been playing better. I do think we see him have a breakout game. Want to know why? It's very easy. Shredded Kitchens? <laughs> hey! O'Hara. Oh, pretty good. <laughs> Thank you. It's Miami. Okay. It's the Dolphins. You, I have to shred this. I think he ends up inside the top ten. This is his breakout game. Maybe his only one he'll give you this season. I have one. You guys ready? Yeah. 
All right, last one for Kira Shredwick here. All right, things won't be incredibly awkward between Kyle Brandt and Jimmy Garoppolo when they inevitably meet at NFL Honors later this year. Oh, my wow. God. Any Does thoughts on that, Trigger? Yeah, does it get wow. weird? What do you do? Do you give the full-on bro hug, or do you do, like, the booty hug? Does he just slap you with a restraining order yeah, right then and right there? Yeah, right there. How yeah. does it go? There's an award for hottie of the year? Who knew? <laughs> Who's the nominees? Even even bother. Uh, it won't be awkward for me. It'll be a, a hard like a romance say... novel. It will be incredibly awkward for all parties involved, don't you think? Yeah. Craig? Immediately, Kyle comments on how good he looks in the suit, and then Jimmy is left thinking, "What is going on?" Maybe you know Jimmy what? compliments me back. <laughs> Kyle, I passed the Altoids. I think it all depends on who's he with. Mm-hmm. Okay. <laughs> that's with me, become... isn't it? Will Selma. No, totally I'll wear a dress if I have to do J-Lo. I don't care. <laughs> Whatever last, I got to do, last baby. Last season, last season. <laughs> no, what's, who's the new thing? <laughs> me. You. <laughs> yes. That has Joe devolved. Yes. Jimmy. I will. I will do we my best to follow dated. that up. Yes. <laughs> Imagine KB and Jimmy now. G and all heck breaks loose. Uh, the Texans coming up a tough loss against the Ravens in a highly published.